talk about the uh, Line L 2025. It was made from 1947 to 1949. It has a 264 configuration. And right back uh, nearby on our display is the DTI, that's Detroit, Toledo, Ireton, Coal Car. Right close by here is the Detroit, Toledo, and Shoreline. There's a Michigan Central uh, box car, a refrigerated car. And over here we have Thomas Tiny. This is uh, four Detroit and Mackinac coal cars. In Mackinac, we got four of those. Michigan Central and the Lionel will be today's main talk. And so today we're actually going to run this Lionel engine, which is kind of cool. It has no traction tires. It's basically like a real engine, metal on metal. Right. When you want to look up like old trains, this being a 2025, I use a line out train field guide. This is 1945 to 1969, and it's by uh, David Dole. And the other one is a TM Books Price and Rarity Guide. And this is line out post war 1945 to 1969 by Tom McComas and James Tufi, and it's volume number one. So once again. This is what we're going to run right now, so I'm going to take this thing down and we're going to actually make this train work. So I'm going to grab it up here and uh, bring it down to the layout. Hopefully I don't get hit by the uh, DT&I coming by. Right now we got a DT&I cast that we're going to load this up in. This is kind of a cool engine. we got an engine and two dummies following the main engine. And as soon as this train passes, we'll put in these. These are all mostly local road names. You got Detroit Mackinac, Ford Motor Company, Ann Arbor and two Ann Arbors Road, Grand Trunk, another Detroit Mackinac, or Verners. This is a Port Huron, and then uh, Detroit and Toledo Iron and Caboose. Now, hopefully, we can get this on here without causing a short, because you guys don't have to cause a short. Everything shuts down, so that's that's running pretty smooth. And we'll get on the. Uh, the engine on and once again we got two up front that's rolling good and we'll got to get this pin hooked up which is looking good and get the other cars in and I think we are ready to go so once again I'll just a little bit a little bit off back here in the back right, let's get a look at the headlight there get the headlight on I think we're in good shape yeah, let's check the whistle out. It's an air horn. This is all coming off the cab one controller. Now, when the engine starts up, you might see some slippage. So, let's fire it up and see what happens. Okay, it's still in neutral. I think I take it down. And then hit the track direction, hopefully we got it. There it is.
I must be watching for another train coming. Yep, there it is. It's a DT9 coming by. He's waiting for the DT9 to pass. And there he goes. He's putting his light away, and up comes the DT9 in the nick of time. So the flag man on the line out to boost had it perfect as the DT9 goes by on its route for Northern Michigan.